Good morning, Adams. Jets? Huh? It's me, Mrs. Island, with your Tuesday morning announcements. Today is April 26, 2022. For lunch, we're having pizza bole, green sliced apples, butterscotch cookie, California vegetable blend, carrots, and milk. Special announcements for today. I have our total for our coin war last week. And the winner, or I would maybe say loser, of the coin wars. First off, I wanted to remind you, so all of you brought in your change and put them into different staff members' jars. The purpose of this coin war fundraiser was to support our community showcase May 13th and all of the really cool things that we're going to be able to provide you as a student and your families. So that is what that was all about. So thank you, thank you, thank you for all of you who have donated. The grand total was, let me check, was $241.06 in a week. That's incredible. So thank you, thank you, thank you. Now I'm going to switch my thank you to how dare you. Unfortunately, I, uh, well, I, yeah, I raised the most money, and so I am uh, the winner slash lunar. With $65 in my jar, I am going to become a human son. And I specifically told you all not to do that to me. <laughs> so that will be Friday, <laughs> Friday afternoon. I'm very upset with you. Okay, I'm gonna go now. Moving on. <laughs> Students of the week for last week. Here you go, are you ready? <sighs> Here we go. Still very upset. Anyway, I'll get over it. Students of the week for last week. Javion J in kindergarten. Alfonso M, Gia R, Lymia S, Angel R, Ever S, and that's it. I thought there was more. Those are our students of the week for last week. Congrats to all of you. Let me double check to make sure I didn't miss any names. I did. Oh, uh, Kamaya J. And that's it. Just had to resort. Sorry about that. Also have some shout outs from last week. Shout out to kindergarten for doing a great job on their field trip to Safety Village. Fantastic job. Shout out to Angel and Katie for being their learning stars of the week in Lexia and Dreambox. <gasps> That's fantastic. And then a shout out to Lymia for scoring really high on her sight words uh, in end of the year testing and showing a lot of growth. Shout out to Lymia. That's fantastic. And then a shout out to Mrs. Garen's class for walking quietly in the hallway everywhere they went on Friday. That's fantastic. Do you know why we walk quietly in the hallway? To torture you. No, that's not it. It's so that you are respectful to all of the other classrooms that are trying to learn. That's exactly why. You are showing respect to everyone else. That's why we ask you to be quiet in the hallway. All right, that's it for our shout outs. Still angry with you about the Human Sunday situation. However, on to birthdays. Over the weekend, birthday was Isaiah J in second grade. His birthday was on Sunday. Happy birthday. Please make sure you come down and get something from our birthday box and some birthday dancing. Last special announcement for today. Last week we had spring cleaning week, which meant you need to clean your space, right? Teachers clean their space, kids clean your space, you as a classroom clean your whole space. We had secret snoopers throughout the week looking to see which class was the cleanest and the most consistent. And guess what? We have a winner. I announced to them yesterday, and it was hilarious because I think the teacher and the teachers were way more excited than the kids were, but it's okay. It was in the morning and maybe they were still sleepy. So our winner, our cleanest class from last week, Mrs. Laborde's pre-K class. <laughs> Congratulations to all of you. I shall work with your teacher and get you some pizza. Okay, so the spring cleaning week is over. However, you don't know when I'm going to do some sneak attacks. That seems weird. Some sneak looks and award some of you with the clean classroom. Because it's really important that our, our spaces are clean and organized, right? Yes. So you never know. You never know. We might get some candy, some random things. Anyway, now it's time for the Adams Pledge. We know how to actually
Um, why is she walking over to the lights? I think she still has some stuff, vampire being in the dark. Um, can you say the magic word to make her stop? Now it's time for the joke of the day. Ah, she's looking why at your hair! Why are the lights off? What has four wheels and flies? I don't know what. A garbage truck. <laughs> oh, karma. This is stinky. Do you get it? Because flies, because flies like stinky things. Little trash, you know? And then flies. That's cute. Thank you, karma. Keep the jokes coming, as you know. Classrooms at this time, you may do the pledge. Today, every day, we celebrate how beautifully different we all are. If today were the day you betrayed your principal, may she forgive you. May that be the day you have. You've betrayed me. Do you know what betraying means? When I ask specifically for things, and then you say, no, I'm going to do the opposite. <laughs> That's betrayal. <laughs> I'm so nervous about Friday. Huh. Okay, well, anyway, I do love you, and despite the betrayal. Okay, have a great day. Be kind to all living creatures, including your principal. Peace out.